Yeah, that was uh, that's on the locker trying to get a damping um. up. <laughs> <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> oh. I move my hands up. Oh, <laughs> baby. <laughs> Good morning and welcome to another fine day on planet Earth. Welcome to Hereford, we are travelling to Cardiff Central today. We're going to be doing, well, we're not travelling direct to Cardiff Central, we're travelling to Cardiff um, and this afternoon we should be doing some whitewater rafting before staying in the new brand by Premium called Zip by Premium, which is a new sort of compact sort of hotel sort of living. We're going to meet Rob this afternoon at probably about five o'clock, so I'm going to travel to Cardiff now, do some whitewater rafting, which I hope you'll take my GoPro so you can see that first hand and yeah we will catch you as the day progresses A good afternoon and welcome to the world's busiest train station I mean look at that look at look at the sure amount of people that have attracted themselves to uh, this station I can't remember the name of we're at Grangetown not too far away from the International Water Sports Centre now so hopefully the next time you see me will be there. I know we've got a bit of a walk when we get to Kogan, uh, but it's just across the river. I might even take some pictures if it's a nice river, but as it's by the coast, it's probably around them little sort of muddy estuaries that don't look particularly uh, pleasing and there's a train coming now, so I'll catch you in a bit. Welcome to the Cardiff International White Water Centre. This I C I W W C. Welcome. Uh, we have funny ride. It is. I thought the train station is further away. I thought it was going to be about a 20 minute walk, but it's actually done in like five minutes. So I'm sort of here a bit, bit early. I went to Tesco's and uh, I'm sort of blown away. It seems a bit cheaper around here. I'm not sure if it's just like I'm used to kind of London's uh, prices, but around here, like I bought a bottle of Coke, it's only like 130, I think it was. Uh, when at home, it's like 140, 150. So I'm not totally sure. Might, I might just be like out of touch with going to other supermarkets. But yeah, I'll give you a, a, a quick guided tour. That is the behind us or there is the actual course. It is fed by the, my brother told me the name of this river yesterday, I can't remember what name it's fed by, it's sort of fed by sort of um, the channel. Um, the rafting is at 2.15, being sort of uh, told to sit, up, start, sit upstairs in a group of two other people, I'm not sure who they are, but um, maybe they could be a couple, maybe they could be individual people, but it should be a good time. I'm gonna hopefully, that's if we have any spare helmets um, with GoPro mounts, mount my GoPro to my head so you can sort of see a, point of view a pov good word pov prospectus of the course and see if we fall out hopefully we won't fall out but no me we probably will in like the first 10 minutes but as ever i will keep you brief well, let's go walk forwards
Vinny's rescue. I'm shooting. Get out of here. And then I can help pull everyone else out. Grab my Good morning and how are we doing? But welcome to my new humble abode, also known as Zip by Premier Inn, Cardiff Ipswich Road. Basically, where we left off was yesterday I was whitewater rafting but never had to pick my camera up again. Um, just because I couldn't be bothered. I'm sort of a half job kind of bloke really. But this is uh, Zip by Premier Inn, I'll give you a very sort of a quick guided tour. It's a new style of Premier Inn, which is £19 a night, however this was £34 a night which is the same as a normal Premier Inn, so with that said, I'll show you what you get for your uh, £19. There's a door there, you get a door and a uh, full, full length mirror, which is which is it's a nice touch. You get um, air conditioning, um, the key slotty in the whole thing that makes the lights work, I can't remember what that's actually called, and some light switches, and a bottle opener. Uh, you get two beds, um, and another bed there. Uh, you get a shelf. Uh, one thing I will note is that the space in this sort of uh, room is very sort of mim minimal. Mim minimal. Minimal! There we go. The space, there isn't actually a lot of space to put your bag, so if you do come here, sort of be prepared if you get up in the night to trip over your bag, which um, you probably would have left in the middle of the floor because there's no really other place to put apart from that shelf. Or on the bed, but remember, you'll be sleeping on the bed, so you'll probably be sleeping on top of your bed. There's a, can you do it under the bed as well? Yeah, there's space under the bed. Is there? I'm glad I've looked under the bed because I've just found my camera charger actually. <laughs> Saying that, unlike most Premier Inns, you get actually a fair amount of plugs in this room. You get um, one uh, AC socket full of USB, um, another light switch, which is actually a reading light, uh, which is that one, which actually points over your bed. Your room will not have a window because this is built into the second half of a sort of a portioned um, sports hall, so uh, you don't really actually have a window because if we did have a window, we'd be actually watching people playing badminton right now. But um, yeah, this is your window, but it, it does have a bit of a feature. It, it changes colour by uh, pressing this panel here. You click that one, and then you change the colours by just tapping the colour wheel. But it's not too sensitive. So yeah, that's the window that changes colour. Uh, you do get a fairly small bathroom. So if you've been to uni, it's like the size of a uni bathroom. So sort of your showers um, there, your toilets there. And your sinks there. Um, also, another thing to note: if you do have a toilet roll in this place, it'll probably be propped up against the sink or sort of balanced somewhere precariously, which is um, was a bit of an interesting find yesterday. With that said, I think I think it, I think the tour's over. Really, you can all go back to what you're doing. Um, yeah. So, with without further ado, please remember to subscribe, comment, like, and uh, yeah, I'll catch you next time. Really. Oh,